Hi, welcome to Ogre Hamster. Today I'll be viewing this Rise Pro wireless thermometer and timer. And this item costs just under $23 off Amazon. It was like $22.90. And well, here's the model number printed on the back right over here. In the packaging, came with a few things. Here's the user manual that came with it. If you want to read in more detail, you can just pause this video. I'll also go over it too. And it came with two probes, essentially just one and the other one is a replacement probe. Each got these rubberized tips on it. And a very nice carrying bag, a little carrying pouch with a drawstring to close it up. Here's a display unit. On the back, it's got a bell clip, a battery compartment for two AAA batteries, which were also provided. A reset button right here. And this is a power switch. I'm gonna flip this on. The back light can be illuminated by just pressing this button up here. Or if I press any button, back light will, will illuminate as well. Now, currently I'm in the US, so I'm more accustomed to Fahrenheit. If I just press mode, I can switch to Fahrenheit. Now, this is just measuring the current temperature from the base unit. The base unit doesn't have anything plugged in. But now, let me plug in one of the probes. The probe is plugged into the base unit. And currently it's just measuring 70 degrees, which is just ambient temperature. Now, there are a couple buttons on here. Starting from the right, here's taste. So for beef, for example, you can have medium well, medium, medium rare, rare, well. And I can also change the meats. For example, lamb, veal, hamburgers, pork, turkey, chicken, fish, and back to beef. Some other function features are on the bottom over here, we got the minute and a second. So let me just press the minute. I can keep going up, increasing it, minimum and second up to 99 minutes and 59 seconds. And hit start, and I'll start counting down. If everything's at zero and I hit start, now it's a timer. So currently I said to beef, also rare, the temperature should be 140, but I placed a probe in a hot water that's more than 140, well more than 140. And if it exceeds the, de the designated temperature, it'll start beeping. I found the temperature sensor on the Rise Pro thermometer to be accurate. The blue one up here, this is what I usually use to measure the temperature of my meat. But except for the blue one up here, this is not a wireless thermometer, whereas the one from Rise Pro is wireless. The probe length is about 7 inches. As for the cable, it's about 3 feet. And the material on the outside is metallic, so it's very durable. It's great that they provide two probes because if I'm grilling meat or smoking meat, well, they can go one on each slab. Or Thanksgiving's coming up in two weeks, I can place both of them on turkey just to make sure that it's cooked evenly on either end. I don't have any cons for this item, but there's just one suggestion that I wish they'll approve in the next release, is that make the core length about four feet instead of three feet. But besides that, overall, I like this item a lot and I would recommend it. Well, thanks for watching this review. If you guys have any questions, comments, suggestions, feel free to contact me. Thanks for watching Walker Hamster. Bye.